Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I've set up this little corner in my room to do this try on haul. This is my first try on haul. I'm a little bit nervous because this is a different angle for me. Like you guys never see my full body. It's normally just like up here. I really enjoy shopping on the websites that I am gonna show you guys. And there's actually two that this is my first time shopping on, but I hear a lot about. Two of these are packages of swimsuits. I don't think I'm gonna try those on because like, no, but <laughs> I am going to show you guys. So the first one, I'm going to start with Nasty Gal. So this first item is described as a waffle, a waffle, no, waffle. <laughs> Did I really just say waffle? Okay, waffle wrap front blouse in the shade ivory. This is what it looks like. Oh, and for reference, I'm a size six in everything. So six shirt, six pants, six dresses, size six. Okay, so this is the top. I feel like it looks exactly how it does like on the model. So there isn't any concern there. The only thing is that I kind of feel like there's excess fabric here. So it's almost like I have to wear a bra with this. And if you know me, you know I'm really not a bra person. So that kind of sucks, but the color of it and everything is pretty. The build of it is very like luxurious, but Nasty Gal stuff is really nicely made. So I wasn't expecting anything else, you know? So this is what it looks like. And then the back is just normal, nothing too crazy, but I really like it. I like the button detail as well. Kind of matches my room decor. <laughs> this is a dress. I thought these were pants, but this is a dress. I actually ordered this stuff a while ago and I'm just now filming the try on haul. I bought this because I thought it was gonna be like something cute to throw on. But now that I'm looking at it, I don't think it's that cute, but we're gonna try, we're gonna try it out. Okay, so now that I got it on, I think it's cute. It kind of makes me look like straight though, but I'm, you know, I'm not opposed to that. Back seems like it has excess fabric right here. So it's almost like it's baggy up here and then like tight around my butt area. But it's not bad at all. Like it's, I could work with this. I could even like, um, if I had a belt, I could use a belt around the waist to maybe like, tuck in some of the fabric that's excess back here. But I do really like like this portion of the dress. Sometimes when you get like those tie up things in the front, it's kind of like low quality of the strings, but it's actually really nice. So I like that part and I like what they were going for, but I probably should have went up a size, but then again, it would be like more stuff in the back, like more, even more fabric. Okay, and then the last thing was these earrings that I got. These are the twist large hoop earrings. I already have earrings in and they're like a hassle to get on and off so I'm not gonna try them on but I'll show you guys them but these are the earrings pretty cute I will definitely be wearing them on my Instagram so keep an eye out you know all right the next shop we're going to try on is forever 21 because I'm gonna save the best for last which is misguided you guys know is my favorite and I don't even remember what I ordered from Miss Guided, so it may even be nothing that I like, but yeah. Because believe it or not, I do have some misses. Like, I like most of all of their stuff, but a few things I've gotten, I'm just like, what? And yeah, so Forever 21 doesn't do like the best as at describing their clothing pieces on the label. So we're just gonna move past that. This first thing that I got is a top, it's a jean top. And because I take a lot of photos and video just up here and up, I like to go for stuff that has more like jazzy shoulders or a jazzy neckline, or I mean, and even basics sometimes cause I'm, you know, I like basics as well, but I really like stuff with a jazzy top. I got the size medium. So I'm either a medium or a six. So this is the top. I'm gonna be honest with you, it looked better on the model. I feel like it looks weird. Like, why does it come down all the way down here? I would have preferred it to just like cut off here and just be the shoulders up there. I don't know, it looks a little weird to me. Let me know what you guys think about this. I mean, I'm still, of course, gonna wear it just cause I bought it, you know? <laughs> I don't know, it just looks a little weird. Um, You have to have someone help you or just 
be patient with zipping it up in the back okay this next item these are pants i'm just gonna throw these on with this because like my angle is different you're not really gonna be able to see it it's more so just like the print of them that i bought them for it has the uh i forgot what it's called maybe pinstripe this this is a basic item that you can just interchange with a lot of different shirts in your collection so these are the pants you really can't see the way that they're fitting it fits a little better when i wear it like high-waisted if i didn't have like my shirt rolled right here i also think the ankle portion you can't you can't see it but the ankle portion of it sits oddly a little bit to me it's like not capri but not like the three-fourth inch or however they call it of the ankles you can't see it but it is kind of weird but the pants aren't bad at all i'm definitely gonna wear them so this next thing is like a basic top but it's a bodysuit so it's like a tank top and it goes into a bodysuit i just thought another like good basic shirt to just have that i can wear like underneath maybe like a throw on cardigan which i did buy a cardigan i don't have any shirt this color so i thought it was perfect and it wasn't that expensive either now to get out of this shirt i've been dreading it that's why i've been <laughs> taking my time the struggle my mom helped me get in this by the way i didn't have to struggle getting it on okay we got it all right hope please I will not be nude on the internet. Okay, I didn't snap it closed just cause I'm about to get right out of it. But this is my favorite so far. Like, and this is nothing. <laughs> it's like a basic brown, but does this brown not look so good against my brownness, you know? I mean, I just think it's too cute. And then look at the back. It's a bit sexy, like it's a sexy basic top. I don't know this is my favorite so far and i'm sure like if i was to clasp it it would even be more snug but i just love the way that this fits and the fabric is really nice especially for forever 21 tanks in the past they've been like they get holes easily they're not really Thick, but this is more of like a thicker material at first i couldn't quite figure out what was the front and what was the back but that was clearly the back because like my boobs were hanging out on this side because i had this side on the front at first and you can imagine how that looks um and the only reason why i did that is because the tag is literally right here on the front and you would think that that's in the back but you can cut these off so actually before i move on i want to try on the outfit that i was talking about earlier this is the cardigan that i bought and believe it or not it is still cold here but Memphis weather if you're from Memphis or you ever been to Memphis it's almost like it's unpredictable 30 degrees one day and then the next day is 70 degrees so we go through like our, our, our weird season but anyway so I can definitely wear a coat right now but like when you're going out a little cardigan like this is super cute like at a bar or at a party or anything like a small little party so this was my outfit idea like something to just throw on if i'm just going and i would probably wear this like lower or one shoulder up and one shoulder off because that gives it a more like midtowny chic vibe okay this next top i thought was so cute i'm not gonna show you the words yet till i have it on so hold on okay are y'all ready? One, two, three. Facts. <laughs> okay, this is nothing. I realize that. But I really like this. And I thought, like, I know when I wear this out, like, with my family or whoever, I'm going to get on everyone's nerves because I'm going to be like, you know, because of uh, facts. But anyway, this is cute. Even with these pants, like, I could tie it up like this, you know, and look very L.A., style you know and this one i really don't feel like trying on but it says happy hour and i thought it was just like another little something that you could throw on either with the cardigan that i bought or you could just throw this on with some jeans and just go out to run a few errands or you could even wear this to happy hour <laughs> this next item is another tee that i bought and it's black with a white rose on it. Thought it was cute. So I'm gonna throw this on really quick. Okay, so another quick shirt to throw on. This is the detailing of the rose. So yeah, thought that was really cute. So this next top is another plain top. It's a very small top. 
<laughs> it's not that much fabric. So this is the top. I feel like I look like a little kid. <laughs> this was not the vibe that I was trying to catch with this shirt. I mean, I feel like I look like like a toddler. Like, okay, snack time. I don't know about this. I mean, I could probably make it cute with like some shades and definitely tucked in into some high-waisted jeans. I'm going to put on this top right here, which I already think I'm not gonna like this because I only bought this for a campaign that I was doing and I ended up not even wearing this. So it's not my style, but you never know. I'm gonna try it on and we'll see. So this is literally a big fat no. <laughs> um i don't know i've seen this a lot like on social media with the little ring thing and i never liked it the only reason why like i said i had to wear a white shirt for something that i was doing and i knew only this was gonna show that's the only reason why i bought it but yeah no i don't like i don't i don't know why i don't like this but i do not like it it just looks strange to me like like what's that what what am I doing in there? It's not something that's my cup of tea. Uh, I don't even know if I'm tying it right. I'm sure I'm not. You're probably going to see it on my Poshmark very soon. I'm going to be selling this. So head over to my Poshmark to check it out if you want this. But the next, oh yeah, and it also zips up in the back. It only zips up halfway. That's how you get in it. But the last thing I'm going to try on from Forever 21 is pants. So I'm gonna put on a different shirt and yeah. So this is another pair of pants that you can't see, but they're like, I think they're called like cargo pants. Is this what they're called? So it, it opens up here, there's a little pocket. And then over here, I'm pretty sure these are called cargo pants. And they go all the way down. The length is really nice. They're pretty like bubbly right in here. <laughs> <laughs> look like I'm somebody daddy so um yeah that's something that I don't really like but that's fine and yeah I feel like the fabric is really nice it's very soft it's almost like a faux velvet like a light version of very light version but it's very soft like that yeah I like these and then it has this little detail on the side little belt loop like to tighten up around the waist it has it on both sides so it's on the center one, but if I want to look like really snatched, I could do it on the first one. But yeah, these are really cute. So that's it for the clothes. I did buy a few earrings. Oh, and some shades. I forgot about these. Very futuristic. Oh, ah, yeah. <laughs> I like these. And then I bought these little hoop earrings that I'm like in love with. You can see like that I have some like a little baby hoop. These are from Target. These from Forever 21. And I just thought they were just too cute. And they're right up my alley on what I like to wear now. Especially since having three holes. I really like the way that it looks. These little bow tie earrings that I thought were too cute just to throw on. Ooh, I am tired. Are you guys tired? Quick stop at AMI Clubwear. I only got two items from here. This first thing I believe is a dress. Oh yes, okay, so I'm going to an all black affair. It's a wine tasting here in Memphis that I'm going to and I'm planning to wear this depending on what it looks like. So I'm gonna try this on really quick. <laughs> Y'all missed the comedy show of getting into this dress. But this is a dress it's very mini let me step back as far as i can it's very mini but i thought it was cute to wear and i'm gonna wear my hair up but it is extremely hard to get into and like look at it with these shades on like what am i chic or am i chic <laughs> it is extremely tight on the arms like extremely tight i can't do really anything in it and it's short on my arms but like who cares it's one night wine tasting no one cares but this is how it looks it shapes really nice, so yeah. Excited about that, probably gonna have to wear my little spanky poo if my stomach is not like this bottom part. Okay, no one cares, y'all don't care about that. It's like this camel color, well they're calling it camel color dress. I believe it's a dress. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to wear this because this is so tight, but I really like it. 
I don't know. I don't even know how I'm going to get out of it. Oh my God. So this is another fave. I absolutely love the color of this. It is so soft. It's not that itchy knit feel. It is so cute. The only thing is that I wish it was a bit wider at the top so I can comfortably do like the one shoulder. It's just really like how, how I like to wear these like pretty much like a long shirt looking dress that's the way i like it like to wear it off the shoulder but it still it still works that way so i'm definitely gonna wear it like that but it is so cute weirdly though this is wet i don't know why it's been in the package maybe because it's been in the package for a long time and it might have been raining when it first delivered <laughs> so it may have been some moisture in there but this is wet so i'm gonna have to hang this in my bathroom that's weird that this is wet but yeah so i really like it though it is so incredibly soft i got it in a size medium and it fits really nice and it basically fits perfect actually okay so last but definitely not least i'm going to be opening my package from this guided i don't remember what i got so it's gonna be like a surprise <laughs> First thing, I got wide leg trousers. Like I said, I love Misguided, but there are definitely some hits and misses. These pants are just okay. I'm probably going to wear them at least once. But like, it's doing this weird little uh thing that I don't like. There's really like not much room in this area to move and breathe. My favorite thing about these pants, though, is the color. I have no pants like this which is kind of bumming me out. They're not fitting right in this region. I'm not gonna be comfortable in this cause I know it looks like that, but I still definitely wanna give them a wear because I really like the color. They also don't have pockets. So that's another thing about these. I'm sad about these pants, but they're really, really nice fabric. This is the next item thrown on to wear at the house. And I wouldn't wear it like this. I would probably wear it like more open or off the shoulder so this next item aka probably the last item that i'm going to try on because the rest are just swimsuits and i'm just going to show you guys actually it was going to be my plan b if the ami club wear dress didn't work out this is another like little black dress that i got so this is the dress i don't know on the model it was cute but like a part of me is just like i don't even know i really like the sleeves though they're like pizzazzy you know cute night out but i feel like this area is probably weird just i probably just need a bra that's really it i'm thinking i'm probably gonna wear this one instead with like some heels yes and then look at the back like the back right here is too cute the ruching i think it's adorable and it's also like ruched on the sides on both sides like basically the whole bottom of the dress is ruched so that's pretty cute some earrings from misguided which i typically always do get earrings from misguided when i order so these are the earrings right here they're like some oversized twisted detail and then i also got some shades which are misguided always has the best shades and I kind of like to pick up a pair of shades as well each time I shop on there because they always have new ones. So that's what these look like. Super, super cute. They're like going to an art show or something kind of shades. And they're different from the other ones because these are like futuristic robot shades. And these are more like, oh darling, I am Leonardo da Vinci's assistant i don't know <laughs> so i ordered some swimsuits also i'm not gonna try these on like i said i got these i think i think these are from shein and this is the top i thought that was just too cute and it's like a bandeau top and then the bottoms are a bit cheeky but still cute and they just look like this this is the front and it's the back they're just plain to go with this if i had a preference my preference would definitely be one one pieces they're my favorites but i got this like one shoulder neon number and it comes with this string I can't remember how it was i'll have to i'll have the photo up though so you guys already know but because <laughs> i'm not looking at the photo i don't know but this string probably tied up somewhere and then 
I got this one and I ordered these based on like some of them I thought were cute and then I saw like the photos of people trying them on and they were telling us like the bottom is too small so I didn't order those so these are supposed to be some good pieces that I ordered but I won't know until I try it on this is actually my favorite one. It's like a lettuce trim. It looks like it's gonna be so darling when I put this on. So I can't wait to wear this one. This one I'm probably gonna wear first. And then these are the bottoms. Seem a bit small, <laughs> but I got medium in all of these, but this one is definitely cheeky as well. I got this swimsuit from Zoffel. I think this is the very last thing. I only got one from Zoffel. And one of these took forever to get here. I don't know which one. But this one I was seeing on my Instagram as an ad. And like when you see something so often, it's like, okay, dog, you really want me to buy this? Let me try it. So I ordered it. And it'll fit better once I put it on. But it is really, really cute. And then these are the bottoms. And so, yes, I don't know which one is the front, but super, super cute. This is like the first time I've actually done like a swimsuit purchase. Honestly, I mostly just used to buy my swimsuits from Target because Target has really, really good swimsuits. But uh, yeah, so I'm super excited to try those and wear them on photos and all of that. All right, so that is the end of this $500 clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really like watching clothing hauls. I pretty much never buy any of the clothes that they're showing me, <laughs> but I really like watching them so let me know in the poll or down in the comments if you guys want to see more of these make sure that you subscribe to my channel which would be on this side and check out my previous video i did a review of the milani foundation and yes thank you guys so much for watching as always and i will see you guys next time bye <laughs>